All right, structure of the team A, the tell me about yourself message. It's really three pieces. You can see what they are on the screen. I am, tell the listener as specifically and as concisely as you can who you are. Think about it as the oral version of the headline on your resume. For me, it's I am certified association executive. It's been my entire career for the most part. It's what I am. If I want to do something differently, maybe I would, you know, if I'm making a shift, I've been in this world, but I want to be in that world, then of course I would change that to what I want to be, right? I am blank. I am an aspiring something else. But, but if I'm staying in the world that I've been in, it's who you are. And I, you know, in the introduction, we talked a little bit about the frequency. Uh, I can't resist using the, you know, Kenneth, what's the frequency? For those of you who may remember that old line with, with Dan Rather, um, because my name's Ken. Uh, it's really, you have to tune the listener in. Because then the listener, like all of you right now, if you don't hear things that resonate in your ear, it's wah, 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 wah. It's background noise, it's white noise. So you've got to tune them into your signal because we know what happens. If you're, you know, again, in the old days, when we actually tuned a radio. If you weren't on that precise signal, one, two, three point five, you just heard static. And it's the same thing with this. If you don't tune that listener into a specific signal, I am a this, 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 then all they hear is, oh, another one of wah, wah, wah. No, they're not listening. So that specific signal, your frequency makes a difference. After you've articulated that, you want to you want to make a claim. I can. Okay, so I'm listening now, and it's it's like the funnel, right? I am. So okay, I, I now know who you are. Well, why are we talking? Well, I can. I can do this. I'm in it. You know, I'll make up an example. I'm a, I'm a sales engineer, and I can deliver superior results for for the organizations that I've been in. Okay. So I'm making that claim and I have to back it up. I have to give a concrete, measurable, quantifiable example to demonstrate the claim that I've just made. And then the third part of the message is I want. Why are we talking? What do I want from you? You know, maybe I want another introduction. Maybe it is an opera, maybe it is a scenario where you are someone who might have an opportunity that I'm interested in. So I want. That's the second, that's the, that's the third of the close. Okay, so again, just to flesh this out a little bit more, I am, define yourself, tune in as specifically as you can. I can, what makes you special? What's your unique claim in the world? In, in the world of the people who I am, you are, what makes you different? And what's next? I want. What do you want to do next? Are you changing lanes? Are you staying in the same lane you've been in before? Um, are you shifting from something you're highly capable of to something that's a passion project that's really meaningful for you? So a little more def definition. Again, your professional frequency makes you memorable, helps you stand out from the crowd. In, in Washington, D.C. area, if you're joining us locally, how many people are you know, in our environment are lawyers, just to pick on the cliche, right? Um, but what kind of lawyer, you know, what do you do? What makes you special in the, in the lawyer, in the legal field, um, you know, sales and marketing, nonprofits, which is my world, associations, my world, what's different about you that make, can make you memorable. 